kind of animal is this? Is that a fucking cat? Ma, look at this cat. Lucine. This hand is really bad. I only have one cycling card to dig because these are two mana cycling. This hand's good. Her, like arm with like a little knife. Why does it look like that? Wow, that's a cool duck. Next turn, alliance, and then cycle for some tokens, and then we can just chump block this forever. Sprite dragons are cool decks usually. Sure. Sure. Do you have a uh, dispute up now? Draw a card, then discard. Target creature gets plus two, plus oh, and first strike and trample. That's scary. We just block to only take six here. damage and then we can probably zenith flare the sprite dragon and hope he doesn't have counter spells Take five here, go to two, possibly one if he's got another instant. I don't think he's got two one mana instants. This is still one turn off ulting. Ah, oh, he's got lethal. Vanishing Light is good for Planeswalkers. Disputes seem good. Didn't really see anything that we want to disdainful stroke. The Gate and Test of Talents are probably good. Shadow Lead Sales is pretty decent. Our Foxes don't seem very strong. Possibly better than the Dranith Stingers or like the Gopher Bloods, though. Probably one, two, three, and then we start using all this other stuff. What kind of animal is this? Is that a fucking cat? Ma, look at this cat! Shock, frostbite. Oh no, it's actually good for him. Nah, 
he is a bone crusher giant. He's gonna stomp me if I block that. I'm just gonna draw a card, look for a land. Tapped out. Attack, and on his turn I can play the Stinger and dig for a second card for my Pyromancer. Let's actually counter it. What are you going to do? Got to negate up. Feels like a good spot to go into game three. We have Riddle Form become a 3 3 Sphinx. No. <laughs> I don't know what it looks like. I can change what he looks like though. There's one for every different color. Take out the Valiance on the draw. Mm, I like the creature though. It was good in that game. Cause like, the alternatives are these cycling cards that don't do anything. This, this is a little bit more flexible. Like, I don't really think I'm fighting anything. The text on this card doesn't, is meaningless. Seems okay. A little slow, but. We have a little bit of interaction to slow them down. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for Magic the Gathering edited videos. I trim it all down so that you don't have to wait for the opponents to take 20 minutes to play a card. It's kind of scary. Basically a two mana three three. I'd love a third land for this Pyromancer because then I can potentially instant speed kill this. I could also exile it at any time with this, but I want to save this for a Planeswalker. Probably just shoot it down with these and save the card. Let's think about this. Now, first thing we're gonna do is kill this. And then when this gets uh, spawned, we're gonna shoot it down after they target it. stomping my face sure they play out a giant I can Casket, or shoot it down. Probably gonna shoot it down. 
Let's shoot down the giant and then banishing light the scions. He's got nothing in hand. First we banishing light. And we shoot down the giant. Start by cycling. One, two, three, four. That looks like lethal. With dispute up, but you know. One, two, three. This doesn't work. Unfortunate amount of mana. I'll make you tap out though. <laughs> oh my god. I just got obliterated. <laughs> the test of talents on the Zenith player. We're so fine. We got these are the new stickers. I think those are kind of stupid. Play this out. Let's build out a board. Oh, do I have lethal? I might just have lethal. Four, five, six. That looks pretty lethal. GG. Yeah, that one I was kind of just playing control on. Huh? 